Hello again, everybody. This is Don Campbell with Expand to Web, and thanks for watching this screencast. Today, I want to show you how to use this relatively new um, thing in Google called Google Web Elements to add a map to your website. So, if you're using the Small Biz WordPress theme or the Chiropractor to Web theme, there's a place that's sort of preset where you can add a map and directions. I want to show you how to do that, and then also quickly show you how to add it to any page on a WordPress blog even if you're not using uh, my themes. So first thing to do is go to this page right here, Google Web Elements. It's google.com slash web elements. And you'll see that they've got a whole bunch of uh, cool little snippets here that you can create to add things to your website. Everything from maps and news and calendars and interesting things. We're going to go to maps here and this is really neat because it allows me to type in an address and a name and it will create oops it will create a nice little um, snippet for me for for my website and so if I scroll down here and just all I need to do is copy this code and then go back to my website and add it in now if you're using WordPress and using this small biz theme once you log into the WordPress admin you're gonna go to the dashboard and if you go over here to on the left and, and open up the appearances section you'll see the small biz options panel this is the place where you can go change all kinds of things about your business uh, and determine how things display on your website and there's this little space right here called Google Maps iframe and if I go and paste that code in that I got from the Google site and then I scroll down and, and save it then when I go back to my when I go back to my website, you'll see this really nice little map that fits right in here. It's dynamic. Um, they can get directions right from here uh, to my place of business, and so it's a neat little way to to add a map to your site. Now, if you're not using the small biz theme and you want, or if you are and you want to add it to a different page, that's easy too. So I can go to a page in WordPress and let's create a new page and say um, maybe we'll call this you know alternate directions or whatever we want to call it okay you go in here uh, and go to the HTML tab there's both a visual and an HTML editing tab you want to be in the HTML one and click uh, go ahead and add in that that content <clears throat> and then when you look at this page you'll see that you've created a neat little um, map and directions page on your site so anyway a couple of different ways to do it and it's a really nice little way to to Utilize Google's tools and put a map on your site. I hope that uh, that this works for you. Thanks